The Miracle League of Arizona provides a special place for children and adults with special needs to play baseball. Rob Werner is joining us now. And Rob, you were able to discover the magic of the league, weren't you? Yeah, I definitely was. Um, it was a really great opportunity, and I was able to report on 18-year-old Carson Harrell. And for him, he told me that the Miracle League really is his field of dreams. Keep an eye on the ball. He may sound like a coach. Foul ball. Or even an umpire. But he's really one of the best players in the Miracle League of Arizona a baseball program for children and adults with special needs. Next battle. He's Carson Harrell, the gentle giant that plays more baseball games with the Miracle League than anyone else. Standing at six foot six, 18 year old Carson was diagnosed with autism spectrum disorder as a baby. His verbal communication skills are extremely limited, but it doesn't seem that way when he's on the field. No. Carson's father, Dave, says that here at the Dan Heron Field in North Scottsdale, everything slows down for his son. It's his best place, and it's a lot like this pretty much everywhere he goes, because kids on the autism spectrum typically aren't friendly and outgoing. He is the most social autistic kid I've ever met in my life. His communication is limited. He communicates with smiles. And smiles are all Carson has when talking about the Miracle League. Boy, Miracle is my favorite thing. Most Miracle Leaguers play one game a week, a few play twice. Carson, though, sets the record with three each week. That's right. And has done so for the last seven years. We bring each player a jersey for each one of their teams with their name and number printed on the back. I can guarantee you, after all these years and all the teams he's played on, he's got to have 50 Miracle League jerseys. I, I wouldn't be surprised if he sleeps in one for pajamas, if he wears one to school. Carson's love for baseball goes beyond just playing. He also hits homers, and lots of them. Oh, Without question, Carson has hit more home runs than anybody in Miracle League of Arizona history, has played in more games than anybody in our history. Harrell has a consecutive game streak that rivals Cal Ripken Jr.'s. In fact, last year, he suffered a lower back injury so severe he had to go to the hospital. But on his way to the emergency room, Carson insisted on coming to the Miracle League to play his game first. Still went three for four. Didn't quite have the power or the speed that day that we're used to from Carson, but he got around the bases, took him a while, most importantly, kept the streak alive. He literally could not bend to get in the car. I had to lean the seat back, recline the seat so he could just pour himself into the car to get here. I call Carson Tigger, like the Winnie the Pooh character, because he's always bouncing. And when he's bouncing, he's happy. And when he's happy, the dude's infectious. Everybody's happy. It's the purest expression of him being happy. He doesn't just play ball. Carson also conducts the national anthem and acts as a leader on his team. But more than all that, being a part of the Miracle League allows Carson to show who he really is, even if he can't vocalize it. Because he can lead through actions, and it isn't always words. You know, usually a leader has to be inspirational. Here, it's just infectious. He didn't speak till he was seven. So before he could really speak, everybody thought there really wasn't much going on in there. And now you can see with just the skill level that he has and the ability he has to draw people to him, he has some natural leadership abilities that can be recognized even without the communication. And when he's on the field, Carson knows what he is. Champion. Um, it gives him a place where he can shine in a world where his communication is limited, where his academics are limited, there's a lot of, hey, he can't do this. There's nothing he can't do at Miracle League. When he comes here and he can be athletic and nobody has to worry about, you know, him communicating and him, you know, justifying and all of that, it's baseball as it was meant to be. It's a game. The Miracle League has no age limit, so Carson hopes to extend his consecutive game streak for many more years to come. The Miracle League has also given Carson other opportunities within the game he loves. This past year, Carson got to throw out the first pitch at a Diamondback spring training game, and he fired a strike. 
It's great to get some baseball in November, let me tell you. How'd you end up finding the story, Rob? I mean, I honestly got pretty lucky with it. Another story fell through, and I was asked if I wanted to take a shot at, at Carson, and I thought it was an amazing opportunity. And he was an awesome kid, so he really told the story pretty well. Just such an inspiring story. Well,